this fighter gang mj here and today we're gonna be watching the departed shout out to excuse me if i butcher your name here laver laver lavere <laughs> hawkins on patreon for requesting this one again if you don't watch your name butcher then don't sub to this one y'all it's here <laughs> Hawkins, I'm just gonna call you by your last name. I'm sorry. Hawkins here <laughs> requested this movie quite a while ago. I didn't get around to watching it, but we got around to watching it today. Just off the bat, I see it has Leonardo DiCaprio, which is one of my favorite actors. I mean, he is like my top 10. I absolutely love him. I also see Matt Damon, Mark Wahlberg, and Jack Nicholson. That's just in the starting lineup. So I think this is gonna be pretty good. It says crime slash thriller, but I I don't even know it's the departed like what kind of name is that? i don't know what to expect off of that i also see that there is a woman in it vera farmiga i think that's how you say her name i recognize her i don't remember where i recognize her from i've probably seen a lot of different movies or shows with her but i definitely recognize her but yeah i'm pretty excited i didn't even bother reading the description because the cover movie poster already looks insane so i didn't even want to spoil myself i just want to get straight into it if you guys are excited as well and end up enjoying my Reaction, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel liking the video really does help me get my channel pushed across the platform and subscribing is just because you love me you love me also if you want to see my full reaction to this movie and every other movie and show on my channel as well as get them early and be able to request them like hawkins here go ahead and click that patreon link down in the description below full movie music and show reactions are there also one more thing before we get into the movie i do want to let you guys know about the youtube memberships i know a lot of you don't know what patreon is or how to use it so i'm going to try to start util utilizing big word there for me utilizing the youtube memberships now there is three tiers you guys can go to my channel and click join it appears that you won't be able to do it on mobile at least from what I've seen but if you go to the website version of YouTube and go to my channel and click join you'll be able to see three tiers the most expensive tier of course to make it even is the $20 tier they will get early access to videos they will be able to request movies in the comments and obviously they get every other exclusive perk along with it I just want to inform you guys about that because I know a few of you don't know how to use patreon or don't know how to get to it or pay for it so I made it even so you guys can go to the youtube memberships as well and before y'all say i'm all about the money if me helping my community get some you know what i'm saying whatever i ain't complaining anyways yeah that's pretty much all i have to say so without further ado let's go ahead and get into the movie so this is a warner bros movie i didn't even know that that's insane i hate warner bros sorry no i don't hate warner bros i lied warner bros please don't block me we are in Boston. What the heck? I want my environment to be a product of me. Okay, just threw us straight into some fights and stuff. All right. Years ago, we had the church. That was only a way of saying we had each other. I believe that. Real head breakers, true guineas. They took over their piece of the city. This sounds like a mafia mob. We had the presidency. May rest in peace. That's what the niggas don't realize. Oh. Yeah, so we're in that era. I got it. Okay, right off the bat, we doing good, though. Don't make me have to come down here again for this. Won't happen again, Mr. C. Ah, okay, Mr. C. So he is, he's some type of leader. Some kind of leader, some kind of uh, mob person. I don't know, something like that. Get your period yet, Carmen? Oh, you creep. A couple half gallons of milk. You like bologna and cheese? Give me some cold cuts, bro. Some mayo in. Dang, he knows he's a real deal. You do good in school? Yeah. That's good. I did too. They call that a paradox. Look where he ended up doing good in school. <laughs> you ever want to earn a little extra money? No, I hate when they recruit kids. No, I hate that. Good boy. That kid's gonna learn right away. Have to take it. Non serviam. James Joyce. Smart Colin. Colin, got his name. Okay, I kind of can sort of see what's gonna happen. Maybe this kid is gonna grow up under his wing, but then end up realizing he doesn't want to be this way or something like that. I don't know. I like guessing, and that's all I can guess. Like that. Jesus. Jeez, she fell funny. 
Francis, you really should see somebody. <laughs> you really should see somebody. <laughs> I don't think you should. What I'm saying to you is this. When you're facing a loaded gun, what's the difference? True. Very true. It's my boy. Terminal ballistics is the study of a projectile. Oh. Oh, no. <laughs> Not you became a cop. It hits the skull. What happens is it mushrooms. And when it mushrooms, it peels back. Oh, you good? <laughs> That's crazy ironic. That's insane. Fireman getting for the first time in the history of fire. Or save a kitten in a tree, you homos. I love his accent. Pencils. Oh, that's Leonardo DiCaprio. So he's also in the cop. I don't. I don't know what it's called. Training class. I don't know. <laughs> Firefighters are a bunch of homos. They are. So she tells me, you never finish anything. You finish the police. What the heck is he doing in this movie? Put it this way, you're a black guy in Boston. You don't need any help from me to be completely f Oh, <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. <laughs> Congratulations to all our troopers. Thank, Thank you. You are dismissed. He doesn't seem very happy to be a cop. Oh. No, no, I'll catch up with you guys. Bagpipes are so annoying. <laughs> like, I understand they sound like music, but it's really... Ugh. School's out. Thank you, Frank. What is it? Can I see? No more pencils, no more books. Okay, so he actually is proud of him. This is like, he's like a father figure. Go, 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 go! Is that understood? I'm glad he's actually proud of him, though. I thought he was going to be mad he turned into a cop. What kind of transition? <laughs> I'm liking this so far though. I, I'm kind of, I kind of want more of a backstory, but I kind of like it though. You're a worker. You rise fast. Like a 12 year old. Thank you, Sergeant. My pleasure. That was, I don't know if that was a compliment. That was a little weird. <laughs> like, say it like that. You can go in there now. You can shit. Mmm, they're approaching him a little different. What's going on? Sir, yes, sir, I have an idea. Whoa, whoa, whoa. See, you have no idea and leave it at that, okay? No idea. Zip. None. Jeez. Uh, be good at what we do, would we? We would be c You calling us c What? <laughs> what did he do? I remember his funeral. Close casket? That's right. Mm. That is before you got kicked out for wailing on a gym teacher with a folding chair. Yeah, don't go mad his demise like that. So he lied? Oh. Sure, I whistle too. Tight booty. Hey, girl. No time you made, Sergeant. That's right, you. What a country. <laughs> Perfect. Mm, so him and that other guy are complete opposites. For cops. All right, this isn't some way. I know you're a worker. Maybe I can do something for you. Why everyone jealous of him all the time? You got any suits at home, or you like coming to work dressed like you're going to invade Poland? <laughs> the departures from our normative behavior. What's this got to do with me, huh? Why are you pretending to be a cop? That's what I was going to say, too. Why are they, like, why are they connecting it back to him? Like, he can't be a new person. You've been selected for it on the basis of intelligence and aptitude. This is an elite unit. He's already flirting. <laughs> we just got here. That's Jackie Costigan. That's an old picture. Jackie met his demise. Last known photograph. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Psycho lives in Brockton with his mother. She's straight out of going my way. Della Hunt, muscle. Oh my God, that's the same crazy guy from, from Shawshank. We've done a briefing book, so read up. I want any and all ideas so I can pass them off as my own. <gasps> Work hard and you'll rise fast. You're in the best possible position in the department. Wow. So they think, they think this guy is faking it, but the other one knows the one that they're trying to catch. He's just not turning him in. That's crazy. And you're hanging in the big, bad, salty projects with your daddy the donkey on the weekends i got that right i would not sit here and take that maybe it's because it's you know like the the cops you got to be more professional but families are always rising or falling in america am i right hawthorne what's the matter smart ass you don't know any shakespeare <laughs> shakespeare i'm the best friend you have on the face of this earth and i'm gonna help you understand something you punk you know cop jeez you will not be a massachusetts state trooper you sure of that i'm sure of that Karen. I love their accents though. I don't know. First of all, Mark Wahlberg, Leonardo DiCaprio, Matt Damon, all of them are holding the same kind of accent. Like that thing is insane. You always have to question everything, don't you? You know, maybe it would have done you some good to have some questions from time to time. Mm -hmm. 
Have I ever been good to my dying sister, or am I just now pretending to be? Yeah. I feel like some people really got to ask themselves these questions a lot of the time. There's a great view of the State House, Beacon Hill, if you can see it. I mean, you move in, you're upper class by about Tuesday. He'll take it. A state police detective. State police detective. He wants that. Yeah, you tend to have a house guest. That's cool. Good. Yeah, just, just give me the papers. Right, like, why are you insinuating that I won't be able to afford it? Loki, they did the same thing to me with this house, and I felt kind of disrespected. But at the same time, I was like, I mean, I am young, so they probably think I can't, you know, I can't do none. All the faithful departed. Through the mercy of God, rest in peace. Aww. So this is probably really the only family he had was his mother and he lost her, unfortunately. That's that Frank dude. You've already pretended to be a Costigan from South Boston. Every weekend, Sergeant. Do it again for me. So I'm trying to understand what they're trying to do because they, they think that he has ties with all these criminals, right? Because they're his family. So they're trying to figure out if he really wants to be a cop. But instead, they're saying they're going to put him through the whole deal. Obviously, they can't hide that he was a trainee. So they're going to put him through the whole deal of pleading guilty to something because his family is full of crime. But I don't understand. I'm a the departed so i was gonna say these guys are the departed then right i'm gonna take a guess and say they are right they're called the departed i know a sean costigan down on l street that's my cousin connected not too bright no offense no nah, i'm not taking you're right <laughs> oh my god good Aunt to Kathy, see how are you good to see you there's aunt kathy smoking a good cig Brought your mother some pictures of my father. <laughs> Look at the smile. My mother had them. My mother's dead. Yeah, rest in peace to your mother. Well, you want me to say it? I'm not a cop. I'm your f***ing cousin. You're, you're bad. Okay, maybe that's what they sent him for. Sent him to do some undercover work, kind of. They kids think they know everything. If they knew, they wouldn't eat Puerto Ricans. Ah. What's wrong with Puerto Ricans? Decided was Say so. Says him. Says uh, Costello. God says as far as uh, concerned. Mm. He's, he talks like his shit don't stink, but he's good people. I like his Uncle Jackie better. Uncle Jackie was excellent. Mm. I feel like he's. So they sent him to do some undercover work or something. Hey, you fellas come from Providence? Is any of your business where we come from? Is it now? What are in cannolis or something? Oh. <laughs> oh, God. Why are you starting stuff with these guys? Oh, See, he don't even think you're helping him for real. He was trying to help him and now he's telling him to get out of here. Look what you did. That's right, I see violent offenders. Bad guys. Not necessarily. Mmm, oh. that looked good. Yeah, no, no, the lobster was good. I just, because it was a French restaurant. Yeah. Surprised. What is <laughs> I'm waiting for you to make your move. I don't know. If that thing moves, I'm gonna shoot it. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> what is that for real? What the heck? So what's it like having people find themselves? Why are they showing us two different lives? Like, I'm trying to understand. Yeah, I do. If you actually do, I'll see you again. Who says I want to see you again? Oh. Don't you? I was even stop playing with her. What Freud said about the Irish is we're the only people who are impervious to psychoanalysis. Hmm, that's crazy you knew that. Mick Cops, are you <laughs> opening up? Good luck to you. Yeah. Why do you do it then? Some people do get better. Oh, she feels like she's really helping. I wanna, I wanna do that. I wanna get into a profession that I feel like I'm actually helping people. I don't know if content is a profession like that, but I don't know, I really do wanna get into that kind of profession. I, I'll always have a job. I'll just arrest innocent people. <laughs> you are trouble. Oh, you don't know the half of it. I'll arrest you right now. <laughs> I love how, how jokey he is, though. I love all his jokes. His mom, they're all a bunch of losers at the parents without mm. partners, so. I mean, y'all are talking loud as heck. It's just us in here, like. Ah, oh, sure. You in trouble. <laughs> you in trouble. Do you know who I am? No. Huh. You such a liar. <laughs> this is bad at the top of the chain talking about no. Mr. French the other night. His real name Mr. French? 
<laughs> that's the question you asked this guy is hilarious i love both like this guy's like he's serious about what he's saying but it's so funny the other one is just joking all the time and i think i love the difference between them do not stop having the mafia in providence this can cause me a lot of problems are they recruiting him or beating him up what they're gonna do is come back with some guys and kill you which sure as you're born do you want me to stop him something i can't do personally <laughs> This guy is so cocky. So full of ego. I knew your father. Yeah. You know he's dead? I mean, he said knew your father, so I'm sure he did. Oh, sorry. Oh, okay. I guess not. Show me your arm. Flip it. Ah! Ah, what the heck? Pull you out of the stadies and send you after me. Just can't know. Oh. What they do in that particular department anyway? Uh. Are you gonna stop doing coke deals with your jerk off cousin? Ooh, this guy is a serious deal. Oh, I know that hurts. Get your hand taken care of. I'm sorry. It was necessary. Was it really necessary like that? Like it's got you all hot and bothered. In the car, you'll see. Do you trust him? This whole movie feels like I'm watching a trailer right now. You can't trust a guy acts like he's got nothing to lose. True. That's very true. Because he really got nothing to lose. I'm reliable. Arnold. You're one in a million. I guess Arnold got nothing to lose. What about your wife, Arnold? Oh. <laughs> she wasn't. But she got reliable. Oh. One too many. She's got a big mouth. Answer this for me, will you? That's why he's so reliable because he got a crazy, like, he cuckoo in the head. They both got nothing to lose. Dang. I saw a dead guy. I think I'm having post traumatic stress. Can I meet you for lunch? Really? He's so goofy for that. He's so corny for that. He's a lux. They're really analyzing this guy. If you look in this car, you'll find the gun that did it registered official providence. In the trunk of the glove compartment. Well, that's gonna be too noticeable that he's connecting everything. On the six o'clock nose. No wonder you get ahead. That's so crazy that he's working both sides, but nobody would ever guess it. Like, that's kind of crazy. You know John Lennon. What is he eating? Is that lobster look kinda good? Yeah, sure. He's a president before Lincoln. John Lennon was not the... Okay. All right, bro. All right, smart ass. You give me a f***ing tuber, I'll get you something out of it. I hate this. That's one of my biggest pet peeves, hearing someone chew and stuff. Now what? Quiet practice. Quiet practice. Who is that? Her, his wife or something? Like, she's always around. I hope this don't shake Rita up. So I remember she ain't that sentimental. Oh. What the heck? Microprocessors, chips. But he says anything about anything like that, you let us know. Okay, so he is still working undercover. Got it. Got it. Quee Baldo, who benefits? Quee gives a shit. It's got a friggin' bow on it. Mm, he's starting to notice a pattern. He's going for my cigarettes. Jimmy Bags. So? Don't worry about it. The guy don't need his teeth anyway. It's a small surveillance subunit. Okay, again, love the switch up between the roles. But it's crazy that technically that other guy who's working for them now is still working for the cops. But they don't know that this guy that's working for the cops is working for them too. That's kind of crazy. I got that. Good. Hi, Dad. I got promoted. All right. Um, I got promoted. You Why don't you just look normal? Like, if your father were alive and saw you here sitting with me, he'd kill seven guys just to cut my throat, and he could do it. Jeez. Your Uncle Jackie, he also would kill my entire fucking family if he saw me here with you. So his family was pretty crazy, but he didn't want to be that way. All due respect, Mr. Costello, school is out. Maybe someday you'll wake the f up. Mm hmm? Etc. and so forth. I am as God made me. Was that your rationale? Oh. God don't run the bingo. May I remind you that pride comes before the fall. Had a tasty relationship before she took her vows. Oh. <laughs> what the heck? Dude, uh, this guy.
guy has like something on everyone. Now, have you made any statements, or phone calls I need to be made aware of? I beat you. He's so confused. I think you need to call your mother, tell her you're not going to be home for supper. <laughs> like, what is happening? I don't know where they're going, but they do, and so do you. So make the call. Just listen to what I'm saying. This dude is insane. Sorry, you had got held up. Yeah, no, you carry on without me. Everybody out, move. What? That's crazy. That's crazy. So he's the rat. Oh my God. He basically told him to warn them because he wouldn't be able to. I swear to the judge I surveilled them there and Abra get Abra. We got a warrant. Why did you use my phone? Because you didn't go in there. Because <laughs> you didn't go in there. So do you want to talk about last night? You know, it's all right. Guys tend to make too big a deal out of it. What are we talking about? What are we talking about? I'm sorry. It's actually quite common. I got to go to work. What the heck is going on? Uh, are they talking about sex like is that what they're talking about good to get somewhere personally or for the f of it some people do it to keep things on an even girl you're saying things too nice you know what you're trying to say you lie so you had a parent who was a drunk right you lie that you know the people sometimes lie to keep things straight you know talk about how you feel how do i feel oh he just misses his mama A toy at my head stop it i like how they just recruited this guy though he's working with him now I ain't gonna hurt you <laughs> i said i ain't gonna hurt him end up hurting him a mass murderer your heart rate is jacked your hand steady that's terrifying that's one thing i figured out about myself in prison my hand my hand for sure shakes all the time, all day long. <laughs> I have tremors really bad. That's part of what I do. I mean, I normally don't see cadets who've been kicked out of the academy. You should get a better job, huh? What? So rude. If they've had trouble at home, if they've had to use their weapons. Use their weapons. They signed up to use their weapons. What is up with this guy? He really not right in the head. What, what was it like for you in jail? Want to hear about the showers? Is that what you want to hear about? Did something happen to you? She's not a very good counsel. Like, yeah, she's not a very good counsel whatsoever. And how about we erase your file? You're just another soldier for Costello. Open to arrest for I don't know how many felonies. That's messed up. Just because you play a tough guy doesn't mean you are when you lace curtain Irish <laughs> pussy. Oh. Oh. Yeah, he's he's losing his mind right now trying to play undercover and then threatening him saying that he's gonna be open for arrest if he doesn't do what they want. Do you want him to chop me up and feed me the poor? Is that what you guys want? No, yeah, well, that might stick. We are building a case. Nah, I feel like you definitely have enough proof. I think Costello's got a spy inside the special investigation unit. Are you serious? I'm afraid so. That's insane. Just a little while longer. We are this close. I mean, I think he's doing a wonderful job to be a cop going, trying to be undercover into there, like have to go undercover with the criminals. Like it's got to be a lot to take in versus the guy who, who's pretending to be a cop when he's really just undercover for the criminals. Like true. I want some pills and you're going to what? You're going to, you're going to close my file. I didn't Is that what you're going to do? File. I mean, she wants you to be open, but if your honesty first and foremost was you wanted drugs rather than you want drugs because you can't sleep, you're stressed out and stuff. You what, can what wait. Did I just put myself through? I'm out of here. Hey, what if that was a legitimate threat? Think about it. Right. You're a horrible counsel if that's the case. Like, I, I think he should have approached it better, but I also think that she's kind of a horrible counsel for not just listening to him. I mean, if you're in distress, I will help you. What's this? It's a prescription. Too damn bad if you don't like my initial clinical reaction. I'm transferring you to another counselor. <laughs> like, I don't want to deal with you. You're going to somebody else. So you want to get a cup of coffee? No. <laughs> Why did it just turn into that? That's insane. Not take action until a man that Captain Queen has inside their operation verifies the transaction. Are we clear? Damn, so he's not going to be able to warn them. Captain Queen is undercover guy. I'm going to smoke right now. You want to smoke? You don't smoke, do you? Right? What do you want, all those fitness freaks? Huh? Go f <laughs> All that. Your mother will be proud. All right. Thanks, Pop. The readiness is all. 
you know the place. Oh boy, you are screwed. They gonna catch on that you the rat. To confess to that anointed pederast, the confessional seal these days, I'm not so sure. Oh boy, oh boy. The guys in log all cell phone signals are under surveillance. It's starting to get more and more noticeable that he is the rat in the group. What? This man is typing without knowing that he's typing. I would say I would relax a little more. There's Costello, Mr. French, there's Fitzy, Delahunt, and the new guy, Billy Costigan. Interesting. Turn off your cell phones. Fitzy's got the chicken. Check your weapons. He didn't turn off his phone. He didn't turn it off. Oh my God, it's just the, the, like I said, the dude that's a cop is undercover as a criminal and the one that's a criminal is undercover as a cop. Like this is tripping me out really bad right now. This dude is doing a good job too. Have you got a camera in the back? What back? Damn, they got a blind spot. I want to tell you, these two of these gents have machine guns. Hmm. Oh, he sounds angry. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> For his own good, tell Bruce Lee and the Karate Kids none of <laughs> Tell them about Bruce Lee and the Karate Kids. Because here, in this country, it don't add inches to your... Oh. Hmm. You know, direct contact with your guys would have its advantages. They really would. Put the f***ing cameras in this place. Oh, who the f*** are you? The guy who does his job. He must be the other guy. <laughs> the one who don't do his job. <laughs> I love, bro, I love Mark Wahlberg's character. He's so funny. This one guy brings the items, and the other guy pays him. Yeah, very true. You gotta do a hand-to-hand off transaction. More fun food, Leon. Lee, check it, check it. Damn, transaction worked perfectly. I mean, Jesus f***ing Christ, please tell me that those Chinaman's cars aren't empty! Uh... Did you put a camera in the back? You stupid f***! Oh, 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 oh. Damn! I mean, he's upset. You cocksucker! Come and kill me! I'm in the I like how they're blaming the surveillance guy rather than, you know, have a rat. Where the f*** is Queen, huh? He's not. Here, all right? You want to meet up or you got something real? Call me back. Hey, he doesn't want to listen to him, though. Four months. Almost four months. You love him? It's a pretty serious relationship. Why is he being so weird? <laughs> yeah, I would lie. To keep things on an even keel, right? Talks about that. You a lie? Wow. You're horrible. Hey, can I look at Yeah, sure. Oh, her moving in on him. Look, I respect who you are. Just, you know, not in the living room. We might have company. <laughs> what you do, the degrees and all, everything you got, you hot sh Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. Because I believe in public service. She just want to help people. That's all she wants. Mayor Sullivan's office. We're calling on the phone right now. Whoop. I guess was that that shrink cunt that answered the phone? She moved in. You <laughs> She's getting serious. Are you listening to me? Yeah. Do you like little miss things sucking on your Hey yo. Yes, yes I do. So I <laughs> Yes I do. That's just so weird. That's just, I'm doing my best thing. What do you think we're in the fucking haberdashery business? He really is trying though. Just get me that information. What I can do is I can just ride we're, we're gonna handle it. I calm down or you're shooting your pants. Man, you're the one being hostile with him. There's some other guy will be putting their fat little Miss Freud's ass. Oh. My mother called me Francis. I know she did. And your father called you the tumor. Oh. And what did your father call you, Charlie? I forgot. It wasn't around. Bro, the disses and jokes is so funny. You rested some Chinese government guys at the border carrying some light sockets. Damn, so they finessed them? All right, I will. That's the move. Yeah, you still want to stay? <laughs> you still want to stay? Nah, I don't want to stay. Nah. But I guess you like to go at your own pace. You got a date with some angels. What's really weird is you can tell he really does love this woman, but he really is just lying to her. And if she is she cheating on him with the other guy? Damn. Just tell me what you just 
fucking set. Forget it. I'm high. I'm fucking high. I must be high. I would never. Mm -mm. Why do you think he never gets busted? Because Stella's a protected FBI informant. What? I thought I was supposed to go into shock. I'm not in shock. It fucking hurts. What? He's a protected FBI informant? That's crazy. My wife's asleep, but she left some supper out. You want something to eat? Yeah, come on, man. You have some supper. We'll talk in the kitchen. Aww. He really trying to look out for him, too, though. I would have never guessed that he was an FBI informant, though. Now he's really protected. Don't move till you're numb. What the heck? What is happening here? I'm so lost. Just fill the f***ing paper in. Your real name and all your account numbers. You sh** me. No, I ain't. You better just do what they tell you to do, bro. If you don't do it, then they're gonna know even more that you're the rat. I'm not sitting here without getting a tetanus shot. Where the f*** you going? I'm not staying, alright? Tell them I said that. Mm, that's funny they're clowning him, but that is how you spell citizens. That's hilarious. Nah, this is not okay. This is not okay. Her man is the rat and, and he's over here. Nah, nah, this is dirty. That's me. Yeah, I know. Look it. She could tell the, the entire different reaction when it comes to her baby pictures. I have to say your vulnerability is really freaking me out. <laughs> me too. I'm over here like all scared. Like, <laughs> you freaking me out a little bit, man. You don't have any cats. No. What the heck? Why would she just have cats? That's so random. I like that. What? That's so random. She is horrible. It's already bad enough, like I said, that he's the, the her boyfriend is a real criminal. She's so evil. <laughs> I'm sick. Shoot, but that body banging though, I ain't even gonna complain. <laughs> I ain't even gonna, hey, look at him. Ooh, Leonardo DiCaprio is so fine. He is so fine. Oh. You have an immaculate record. Some people don't trust a guy with an immaculate record. I do. I have an immaculate record. Mm. At least somebody can stand the side of the Ladies see the ring, they know immediately you must have some cash and your cock must work. Mm-mm. Overtime. I'm glad to hear that. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I don't like that he hired him to do investigations, but he's the rat. He's the mole. Obviously, they don't know that, but it's just like, it's so goofy. Talking about follow the envelope. Oh no, he's gonna follow him here. Dirty, dirty. <sighs> huh? Why can you just watch corn in like regular movie theaters? Not turning into one of them sob sisters wants to get caught. You're not cracking up, are you? Mm-mm. Any cop could see you, Jesus. If I can bad idea, why'd you show up? I own the place. Uh, <laughs> he's smart, he owns the place. Where'd they put you? I gotta find myself. You're telling me, sonny boy. No, like... Everybody looking up their own ass and you looking for yourself. I put my money on nobody finds nothing. Very true. <laughs> I get visual ID suspect. How is he gonna do that? If you don't find that cheese-eating rat bastard in your department, it won't be me who suffers. Now we know. Would I be any good at what I do? If I didn't already know that. Literally, he's the rat in the department. Like, I, Frank gotta give him more credit. Because Colin has been really putting in his work with, with telling him everything. Maybe because it's always been so easy for me to get cut that I never understood jacking off in a theater. Very true. I don't understand that either. I you gonna have to follow him to ID him. He's not going to be able to ID him. He's probably either going to lose him in the crowd or he's going to take off the, the hat and stuff. Damn. Couldn't get a look at him. Nah, he lost him. See, I knew it. There's too many people. He lost him. He couldn't get a good look at him. Ooh. 
Oh my god, the suspense is so weird. Make arrest? How? How is he gonna make an arrest? <gasps> you just killed an innocent man. Oh lord. Oh lord. It is not easy being a rat, huh? That's it for me. Have a good one. I don't know, man. I don't know. It's just they're it's too they're too close to finding out that he's the cop and they're too close to finding out that Colin is the rat. Like I just it's starting to get too scary, like You got a girlfriend? What does that matter? Depends. Ugh creepy old man. Girlfriend or stupid. Stupid, huh? Yes, that leaves me out. <laughs> You're funny. Nah, I already know you the rat. That's not playing. And I think, could I do murder? And all I can answer myself is, what's the difference? Mm. And I will put a fucking bolt in your head as if you were anybody else. Okay? Oh, you aggressive, man. I got this rat. This annoying, cheating fucking rat. Ew! <laughs> the face is so ugly! It's a TDD fucking rat. I don't want to make the face, but that was really funny. Frank, look at me. Look at me. I'm not the fucking rat. Okay? Mm-hmm. You, William, what would you do? What would you do? You don't pay much, you know. It's almost a fucking feudal enterprise. He's trying to get in his head, and I, I see that, but I feel like he already got too much evidence that you're the rat, so. The only one who could do what I do is me. I like people had to die. Mm-hmm. Heavy lies the crown sort of thing. Yeah. Mm -mm. I really hope he's not actually getting into your head. You learn a lot watching things eat. This man just ate a fly. Ew. Eat something. He is scared for his life right now. They are not happy with me. Everybody knows you've been assigned here to find Costello's rat. They want to find the leak as much as you do. Mm-hmm. They're jealous. Don't be surprised. They don't buy you a beer or invite you into their homes. Dang, this is a lot, man. No one's gonna trust him. If I wasn't a trooper, but another city, I was thinking that. Another city. Oh, this man's trying to find a way out of it. Oh, Lord. If we're not gonna make it, it's gotta be you that gets out. Because I'm not capable. Oh, sad he even gotta think about that. Yeah, I actually love, I'm really loving this movie so far. Uh, surrounded around the Irish mob, but it's literally showing us two different lives. See that guy over there? Not paying attention to us. He's a cop. Oh, okay. You get it now, do you? That guy's not a cop. You're so dumb. What this guy? A cop. They're all just cops now? <laughs> she ignored us, so she must be a cop. She's probably the police commissioner. <laughs> y'all are dumb as hell. Maybe they just don't want to talk to y'all weird asses. What the heck? Thought I was on for this. I changed my mind. Take the night off. Oh, that's not gonna be good though. He's getting a whole new crew. He's getting a whole new crew. That way he'll know if the rat's actually in his crew. Not a thing. And I would have. That information would have come to me. It ain't Bill. No way, he says. Damn, and then it's not circling back to Bill too? Shoot. I have reason to believe that Captain Queenan is Costello's rat. Follow him and don't get made. Mmm, okay, so he's trying to find uh, the cop in Costello's crew by following this guy because he's most likely going to meet with him. And Bill, uh, or Will, Bill, whatever, he insisted that they meet today. So that's really interesting. Mm, okay. They think he has a tail on him. Yep, so he does got a tail on him. Obviously, we knew that. <laughs> but clearly that guy who's an actual cop can tell. I'll get you out of this. I cannot do it overnight, but I will get you out. Get the van, we're moving. Heavy work. Oh, <laughs> you're in so much trouble. We found the rat. We're gonna take him out. The address is 314 Washington Street. You got it? All right, we'll see you there. Oh. Come on. 
Oh crap. He said 314 Washington, but it's 344. I'll be fine, but if you get made, I can't protect you. Go, go. Oh, no, nah, you're screwed, buddy. All y'all are screwed. He's studying law. What's your name? And boy! Hey, hey, hey so No, no, you're, all, you're done. Damn. Naughty landed right in front of him too. Oh my gosh! No f pursuit. I need some information. What came off the roof? No pursuit. Yes. Uh uh. He just said no pursuit. <laughs> Dang man, he just said no pursuit. This just turned into a freaking. Show. like his goal was something else entirely but now that he's dead it's kind of like it kind of added up i forgot the password but if you want to come down to the garage with me i'd be happy to give it to you it's a lie nobody calls mm -mm. cleaning is dead i'm your boss now mm -hmm. i need those codes you want those codes so why the f are you mm. boss told me to go home maybe he did maybe he didn't but you went out home right don't lie bro but then you show up today it's a red Mm-hmm. You've never been late in your life. When I called you. That tells me you're the rat. I made a mistake. I gave you the wrong address. Yep. I knew it. You showed up at the right one. I knew it. Yep. Tell me why I didn't tell nobody. Tell me why. <laughs> and then he dies. Oh. Oh my gosh. Dude, you're you're screwed. <laughs> if anybody else finds out about that information, you're literally done for. He's so hot for me, we give him a whiff of my ass, he'll crawl right in it. Let's give him a whiff. Hmm? Sweetheart. You're giving me a heart, huh? Ew. Watch your fing mouth. No, you watch it. Let me straighten you out. I love their relationship though, low key. Like she really stays with him through through it all, you know what I'm saying? I tried to call you a few times. Yeah, I know. Oh what, you feel guilty for cheating now? I can't be a friend to you. I'm sorry. Now she wants to feel guilty for cheating. Now she wants to feel guilty. Okay. <laughs> okay. He knows it's his other phone. Like a ghost calling from the dead. Ooh, it's so creepy how they're both so quiet. He's trying to get up out of there now. <laughs> oh no. Not they waited for each other. <laughs> Yo. Oh. We need you to come in. Can you come in? Mm mm. Who is that? Oh. Is that of Timothy Delahunt, an undercover policeman for the city of Boston? Oh. And dog and three feet a month. What kind of size a dog is that? Doesn't be a big fucking dog. That's what you're thinking about? Oh my god. I tell you to dump a body in the marsh. You dump him in the marsh. Bro, he tried. To get a fucking Don't laugh! This ain't reality TV! Like, does he not notice he's the only one laughing? Damn, but now they're not gonna look for the cop, and he is the cop. Damn it. Get rid of the fucking tail! <laughs> the silence. How do you expect them to get rid of the tail? He is so scared. Where he's going. Yes, and what he's doing. So get rid of the tail, get special ops on standby. We'll take this prick tonight. No. Fall back. Hey, I lost my leg. Dang. Dang. 
What are you gonna tell them though? Cause he's not gonna be there. Damn. Dang. Loaded. But then he actually still took them to his location though. Not in the f car. Yeah, what if they took one off and they put another one on? Load. Mm -mm. Frank wants me to check the back, all right? You go ahead. He just didn't want to get caught. Uh, wow. I don't like how there wasn't a loud sound effect for the car crashing. Damn. Dang. So that means he actually did give him away though. Like the dude who was supposed to be on his side. Oh. My guy said F it. He just said F it and did it. Dang. Huh? He's right there, huh? You're an FBI informant? Are you f***ing kidding me? Grow up! Wow. All that murdering and f***ing and no sons. Mm-hmm. Damn. Hey, man, you were gonna shoot at him. He has to protect himself, I mean. Damn. Well, at least he went down. Gwen. Where the hell's Frank? Frank got shot. When we lost Frank. Oh Lord. You better call him back here, make it seem like your self-defense. I got Costello here. Damn. Now these are, I would say right now they're gonna think he's a good ass sergeant and stuff, but he didn't really want to do that. Now they're never gonna know that he was the rat though. That sucks even more. I just want you to know I'll be recommending you for the Medal of Merit. It's kind of like a gold star around here. Huh? <laughs> it's like kind of like a gold star. But anything you can give me. I'm all done being a cop, all right? I just want my money and I want to go home. Money. This computer's getting all friggin' bluey on me. I'll have you out of here in no time. Mm-hmm. He's gonna put two and two together too. They both gonna put two and two together. He found the citizen's note. Oh my God! <laughs> this is not good. Imagine he would've looked back right there. <laughs> Let's see the that's running. Yep. Mm-hmm. He some found the letter too. Oh, you better run, boy. You better run. <laughs> he deleted his record. Open this if something happens to me, or if I call you and I tell you to open it. You're the only person I can trust, all right? Oh, I love that she's the only person he can trust, though. Like he will not put his trust in nobody else. Sorry to even show up here like this. There's just no one else I could give it to. There's no one else. That's even worse though. She's with the guy that's the rat. And if she, if that has some kind of information. Think about it real hard, all right? If you still want to tell me, you tell me in two weeks, okay? Aww. And she probably likes him more low key because he treats her a little better, you know? <laughs> Don't open it. Yeah, just, just listen to him. Open it. What is that? Really? Don't tell me she's pregnant. Don't tell me she's pregnant because it's going to be even worse if it's not his. They say that this little speck. Oh my gosh. It's a boy. Well, yeah, well, one usually follows the other. I bet you it wasn't even him that got her pregnant. That'll be the even crazier thing. Yeah, play so he can't hear it. Shoot. Oh, wow. Just let me do it. Let me do what I do. If it involves lying, then I'm pretty good at that. Damn. What? We got a cop in my 
crew. Yeah, I know. I'm. Oh, <laughs> you lying bastard! I thought I was the liar. Hey, I can explain that. No, you can't. No, you can't. Quality good enough? Cause I was a little worried. What do you want? I told you I want my identity back. You two-faced. Oh boy. Three o'clock. Where Queen and died. You keep your cell on. Ooh, that's bad. Oh, that's bad. I knew there was a reason they're showing us two lives, two pasts like that. Like, that's crazy. Didn't we already talk about this? This is my job. Your job as a rat? Hmm, interesting. Shoot a cop, Einstein. Watch what happens. Well, what happened is this bull would go right through your head. Right, he would not care. You and arrested you. That's the stupidest thing you could do. Shut the <laughs> He's beating the crap out of you. I got boxes of tapes, evidence, other documents proving it. Mm. I'm taking him downstairs now. He's not going to shoot him. Yeah, he's not going to shoot him. He believes in him. He believes him. Yeah, they're not going to trust you. To explain this to a Suffolk County jury, you f***er. This is going to be fun. He has proof of everything. Like, you're in, you're done. You're you're done, buddy. This Kill me. I am killing you. <gasps> what? Why? What? Why would? Holy. What? Did you think you were the only one he had on the inside? Oh, wow. FBI. It's you and me now. You understand? We gotta take care of each other. You understand? Oh my god, what the heck is happening? What is happening? I don't even understand what's going on right now. I am just so lost. I just want to go on record. I'm recommending William Costigan for the Medal of Merit. Wow. Wow. This is so dirty. He's like, what the heck is she doing here? Little do he know. <laughs> Little do he know. He's piecing the puzzles together right here. Yeah, he's gonna try to talk to her. She's like, what about it? <laughs> Screw you. <laughs> she do not care. Oh, they don't even like you. Drag that pup away from you so fast. Okay. Oh. Well, we knew he was coming back. <laughs> we saw that coming for sure. Dang, y'all all got laid out. Every single one of y'all. Not a rat! <laughs> That's crazy! It's a rat on the balcony! <laughs> oh my gosh! Wait, that's it? No, I wanna see what was in the letter. I thought that they were gonna show us what was in the letter that he gave her and told her to open and if he came up dead, which he did. I, I, I wanna see what's in that letter <laughs> or in the package or whatever. Dang, that sucks. A lot of that movie felt like a trailer, <laughs> like a action packed, you know, crime mob trailer. It's a little long, obviously. It's a little longer movie, but this is again, one of those movies that didn't feel too long, but it was definitely, I don't know. It was weird. I can't even describe it because it was weird. So many twists and turns. Um, and like I said, showing the two paths and the two roles, the undercover cop being a criminal and then the undercover criminal being a cop. It was really, really interesting how they showed those two paths. Um, but overall, I really, really enjoyed this movie. Like I did mainly because of the Irish mob. That was really entertaining how they, they showed like the same way with all mob movies. But in this one specifically, you know, I enjoyed how they showed that Frank act like he was
was untouchable. Like there was no solid evidence on him, nothing could happen. And then to die at the hand of the one person that you were getting information from and really depended on viewed as a son, to die by his hand is even crazier. I really, really feel bad for, for William though. Like he was actually, I feel like he was actually a good person. He just needed some help and obviously things didn't end well for him. He tried to do the right thing and it just didn't end well. So it was pretty sad, but nonetheless, I still really enjoyed it. And I hope you guys enjoyed that as well. If you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Yeah, that's pretty much all I have to say. So thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you for tuning in. This has been MJ and don't ask about Spider-Man. Peace.